In what could be our biggest injury update for 2014, the Gold Coast Suns are set to monitor the health of four players ahead of Saturday's clash against the Western Bulldogs. Let's throw the high performance manager Stephen Swert. Uh, Swert, we might touch on Gaz in a second, but first, uh, Charlie Dixon did sub out of the match with a calf complaint. What's the latest on him? Yeah, well, Car uh, Charlie hurt his calf. He got a kick in it nearly the first contest of the game, and um, and he had a, quite a bad court, court calf. So uh, he made it to just after half time. We tried him after half time, but he was still a, still a bit sore. So. He was subbed, and then uh, so it's a matter of just seeing how he goes this week. He, he, he's still a bit sore early in the week, as you'd expect after a bad cork and trying to get through, you know, two quarters of footy with it. But um, we'll give him all, all chance, and we'll make a decision, decision later on in the week. Trent McKenzie also left the ground with a hamstring injury. What's the latest on him? Yeah, well, Trent Trent sustained a, a slight strain in his hamstring, and he'll he'll miss a couple of weeks, probably two or three weeks. We've got a bye next week, which is. Uh, yeah, fortuitous for Trent because he won't miss as much but uh, yeah he's at the low grade end of a strain but he, he'll miss some weeks and um, he'll go through the process of rehabbing that and get himself back in, the, in a few weeks time. Shawnee Lemons also copped a pretty nasty gash to the head and was later treated with concussion. Uh, what's the rest of his week involved? Yeah well Sean got assessed again this morning and he started some training so there's a pretty strict protocol in, in place in regards to players returning from concussion you go through a number of steps and hopefully they, they pull up well at uh, progressing those steps which he's done so far so he'll train he'll do some training tomorrow with the team and each day to get checked but uh, so far so good with Sean so we're pretty optimistic he'll be okay. And finally our skipper Gary was sent to Melbourne for further consultation with shoulder specialists uh, what's been the process and where are we at at this current point in time? Yeah well the process is uh, it's pretty standard in regards to injury a player comes in after the game on a Sunday or a Monday morning gets assessed which Gaz did with with our doctors scans were done just to eliminate the worst case scenario which we've done and so uh, and then the next per part of it is consulting a specialist to work out what, what's the next course of action. So Gaz did that today in Melbourne this morning and we're just waiting to find out what the decision has been made from the specialists and Gaz in, in consultation with our doctors. Thanks for your time, sweetie. Thanks, Sean.